So today, I'm going to show you how to change the fob for a John Cooper Works surround, and I'm also going to show you how to fit the lanyard for the John Cooper Works. So, most importantly, the key and a little screwdriver with a flat end. So all we're gonna do is push the silver bit on the end, okay? Then we're gonna slide the screwdriver underneath, force it under, and that should give up the ghost. So we'll give that a little tug, okay? This section here will now slide off with a little pull. We'll get the new one out of the box, and then all we're gonna do is turn the key and just slide that back on. Lovely. Oh, sugar. And all we're gonna do is slide it back on again. There we go. So now we'll spin that over, push that back. That's now locked in. And that is the fob done. Now for the John Cooper Works lanyard. Here she is. So here you've got a little clip that goes in. So this section here just slides in to there, like so. Now with these, you do need to use quite a bit of force. So put it in place and then give it a real good squeeze and then that should clip in. And once that's clipped in, you've got the lanyard there as well and you can always release the key as well if need be. So there is your lanyard with a nice little John Cooper Works decal on it as well for your John Cooper Works. Go and enjoy the car. Take care, bye bye.